Hi everyone, welcome to another video. Today I wanted to show you how to get a really really cool, really glittery um, shimmery lip that is also long lasting for Christmas. Um, I got this idea when I watched Dusty O Hunter's videos about his lip combinations and I think that that was a really really great idea and I put his channel down below. And I found a way how to make a really cool glittery lip that is also really really long lasting and I'm gonna show you how to do that. So I already um, have some simple makeup on with just um, Myla eyeshadow all over the lid and then a little bit of wet in the crease and underneath and then just mascara and a black eyeliner. Today I also use this which is the Laura Mercier Face Illuminator. This came out recently and it's really, really pretty. And I don't know if you can see it. That's a swatch. It's so pretty on my skin tone, it's unbelievable. And I put loads of that on because I love it. I've been wearing it every day since I got it. And it's really, really pretty. So. The way I've been doing it recently, when I wanted a really long lasting glittery lip that doesn't come off, is to use one of these babies. And as you can see I'm completely obsessed with them. These are the Revlon Color Stay Ultimate Liquid Lipstick. And they're supposed to last really really long and I have a bunch of colors here. They range from nudes to light pinks to reds, this is top tomato, to bordeaux and I really really like them they are about 8 pounds or something in boots if you can't get hold of them you could also use something like this which is the Maybelline Superstay 24 hour lip color but I actually do prefer these ones because I find even if you put too much of these on they don't get as crumbly because they if you put on too much they can get um, quite crumbly on your lips and just start breaking crumbling off and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna put one of these lip colors on top of my lip as the first step okay I'm gonna use this I'm gonna go for a light pinkish lilac -y color and this is the Revlon Colorstay Ultimate Liquid Lipstick in Iconic Iris number 35 and I'm just gonna put it on my lips What I like to do with these is blend the edges with my finger and then you're gonna get a very natural kind of finish. So there's no need to use a lip line or anything. So this is how it looks. And then I'm gonna take some glitter. This is the Berry M glitter in number fine this is the Berry M glitter dust in number seven or six hundred forty seven, I don't know. And it's a pink glitter with silver. So what I'm gonna do, lick my finger, put my finger in the glitter, and then press it on my lips. And you need to work kind of fast with that because the lipstick is gonna dry and you need to get the glitter on before the lipstick completely dried. And that's the finished look. Really glittery, Christmassy, pink lips. And I think the best way to wear it is to either wear matte cheek and only a little bit of shimmer on the eyes or to wear some shimmer on the cheeks but then a matte eye. So try, try to keep one or two areas on your face matte so it doesn't all get really really shimmery. Uh, if you want to have kind of a dewy makeup and shimmery cheekbones then um, use matte eyeshadows or you know use a matte blush and no eyeshadows try to keep kind of a balance and mix it up because if you use shimmer on the eyes on the brow bone on the cheeks on it you know as a highlight then it's, it's just you're gonna look like a glitter ball and I'm gonna show you I'm gonna kiss my hand now and show you now that the lipstick has dried how how that nothing's gonna come off and that's everything that came off. 
So a little bit of glitter and a little bit of um, the middle part of the lipstick where I was still drying. But I can assure you that this is gonna last on your lips like very very long time because I tested it and I was eating and drinking and there's no need to touch it up and that's just what I love. I don't like having amazing makeup and then after an hour it's all gone and I really hate that and I don't want to run into the bathroom every hour to touch it up. So I really really do like it and I'm gonna go in the bathroom and try to get it off and show you a second look so I'm gonna come back in a minute. Okay guys, now I have the glitter everywhere and it's so hard to get off. I have two more glitters here so I'm gonna show you another way to do it. So let's use something a bit more yeah okay let's use this um, color which is called number 10 premium pink so it's the same procedure you just put it on your lips and make sure it's all nicely distributed and not outside of your lip line and make sure your lips are kind of don't have any product on before and then really fast before it dries take your finger wet your finger I do it with speed, you can use water, whatever. So the glitter sticks on your finger and then press it on your lips before this um, long lasting lipstick dries. So it seals in the glitter and the glitter won't come off. Make sure you get all the edges. Again, just soften the edges with your finger a little bit. Take your glitter. This time I'm going to take MAC Reflex Pearl. Wet your finger so the glitter sticks on it. Ta-da! And then press it on your lips. This time I'm just going to do it, place it more in the middle of the lip and not over the whole lip. Obviously you can, you know, just do it as you prefer. So this is lip combination number two. I really hope that in this camera you can see. Oh, shall we make the kiss test again? So, okay, I'm gonna kiss my hand again. And this is all that came off. So that stuff really, really, really lasts. Because those lipsticks on their own, they last all day and I've been testing them out quite a lot and I have loads of them. And they really lock in the glitter so the glitter won't come off. Okay, that one came out more like a spaceship futuristic kind of lip color, but um, you you get you you get from the first two um, options I showed you how how nice it could look and that it really lasts all day and you could have like amazing amazing lips. Everyone will ask you about and I'm gonna have to leave that on now because it's really hard to get off. So I hope this was helpful, even though the last one turned out a little bit funny, but I hope you liked it and it helped you a bit and you're going to create some really nice, glittery, shiny, shimmery, long-lasting lip um, creations on your lips. So another thing I wanted to do is, I've actually planning for quite a while and this is going to be a giveaway and I didn't write it in the title or anything and I didn't say it in the beginning of the video for one big reason because I want to give people who really watch my videos till the end and who watch them even though there is no giveaway you know in the title a better chance than anyone else if you know what I mean. So if you watched this video until here I know that you're really watching my videos and I want to give back something to YouTube and thanks 
to everyone who subscribed to me and for the kind words and it's been a lot of fun and I thought for Christmas I'm gonna do a giveaway so I'm gonna show you I'm gonna have three packages and I'm gonna show you what the prices are so everyone gets nearly the same everyone will get three Viva La Juicy Juicy Couture or the perfume samples which is that perfume here Oops. then everyone will get a Essie Fall, Colle Fall Collection mini nail polish collection and it has those four colors in it and then everyone will get a Calvin Klein eyeshadow brush like that two bourgeois eyeshadows um, they will be in different colors I also have some light colors so you just get two and the colors are gonna be a surprise and then everyone will get a Berry M nail polish in mushroom and then um, the thing that's gonna be different is one thing so everyone will get the same things except one thing's going to be different and in order to enter I want you to write in the comment one of those things so I know which package you want so um, one of you will get as well as all the other products I just mentioned will get the Topshop bronze and blush duo and I really like that I have one for myself and it's called burning embers and the blush is a very nice peachy blush which I really like and I use it quite a lot for myself so I thought one of you will get that in a giveaway so if you want all the products I mentioned before plus that then write something in the comments that mentions um, blush don't say I want to win the blush package because then everyone's gonna know write something in the comment just mentioning the word blush if you want all the products but the eye and lip pencil set which has a black um, eye pencil and a lip soft velvety lip liner and this is also from Topshop So if you want the set that has the Topshop Glow um, polished cream highlighter in it, then write something in the comments that uses the word Glow. And what I'm going to do, I will choose a winner. I will choose three winners on randomwalk.com. One for the, glow, for the set with the Glow. Um, highlighter, one for the set with the lip and eye pencil set and one for the set with the blush. Yeah, but only from the comments that actually mention those words I just told you, so not all the comments will be chosen, will be put in random.org. And the rules are obviously you must be a subscriber. I would love it if you follow me on Twitter as well, which is always linked below, but it's not like a must or something. And if you are under 18, you must give the consent, have the consent of your parents that you can give me your address so I can send you the things. Um, you can enter until the 2nd of January. All the entries after will not be counted. So I wish you good luck and I will announce the winner around the 2nd of January. And I will send the packages to you when I get back from Austria. I also wanted to ask you, do you want me to film some videos while I'm in Austria or just have some footage from Austria? And also, um, if I open a blog, what would people like to see there? Um, or, you know, some tips and what what is also the best um, blogging platform? I'm researching that a lot at the moment. So if anyone has any good tips, then let me know. and. So I wish you all a Merry Christmas. I hope you have something really nice planned. See you soon guys. Bye.